Welcome to our virtual walkthrough at 24 Bulgroon Crescent Ocean Shores. This three bedroom, one bathroom home with a single garage here is on 923 square meters. This is the view looking down at the street. So it's a really nice quiet street here. The house is quite elevated up from the road. Um, really nice part of Ocean Shores. So you've got that elevation, lots of yard there to the front. I'll just show you this garden here. So lots of tropical, uh, beautiful palms in the front yard here. Quite a dense rainforest through the front there as well, which is giving you great privacy from the road and really beautiful elevation. The house itself was built in around 1985. This is Sally. Sal, give us a wave. <laughs> so coming through the home, keep my shoes off. Okay, so the property is currently tenanted. The great tenants here, they're keeping the property really beautifully. So you've got air conditioning in the lounge room. Here's that front window again, looking down that driveway, nice elevation there. Coming around here. So you've got internal access from the garage. Okay. Nice little garage. Again, fabulous tenants in place. And then you've got that door the back of the garage there looking out as well so you've got double access internal external and then your roller door here roller door isn't motorized um, but it is lockable coming back into the home so front door over there lounge room to the right here and this little space here I guess kind of like a little nook I think it'd be great to use as a little study or something um, a little play area for kids and that's got nice window looking out to the backyard there I just love the layout of the lounge room here too which is really nice coming into the kitchen so there's loads of character in this house so, uh, I think there's a lot you could certainly do with the property loads of potential but really nice just to leave as is too and as you can see the tenants have really made a home here which is beautiful great layout for a family always great to have the sink and kitchen area looking out to the backyard which is great over to that side where I'm pointing outside now that's where the pool is to the side of the house um, and then this side is sort of um, you know to the back of the garage space uh, we've got the so there's a euro made oven and range wood here. Um, got the oven and cooktop, which is Euro made. And then I'll just come back here. You've got a Bosch dishwasher. So Bosch dishwasher and then a freestanding stainless steel island in the middle. So that's your kitchen area. And turning around here, you've got the dining. So that's a great space for the dining room. I think that looking at the layout now, I think originally when it was built, this may have also been the dining room as well here. That could have double as a bit of a dining room connected to the lounge room. So coming back through the kitchen and then you've got dual entry here. So that's the front door again great layout nice open plan through the house here and then this end is where the all the all of the bedrooms are so you've got three bedrooms built-ins in here again nice big windows in every room looking out to the front um, and you've got fan in this room as well which is great so I think you get great airflow here with lots of elevation and big windows in all of the rooms. Coming around here, 
there's an air conditioning unit in this room and then you've got built-in robes here and then you've got your outside here looking out Oop. so you've got that garden area there and then there's a little another access to the side which would be behind the um, side of the house where the pool is at the front there so kind of a two driveway which we'll have a look at in a moment the main bathroom so again I'd say this is an original bathroom um, looking out to that pool which looks beautiful hello and into the bathroom area so these tiles on the floor have been painted but I'd say they're original with the home we've got bedroom number three here so this would be the smallest room of the three it doesn't have built-ins but great for a nursery or a children's room or an office although you do have the space in the house for an office as well um, nice big laundry in here which is good okay and then separate toilet which I think is always a really good design plan when you're building a home so house was built around 1985 um, I'll take you out the back now So coming out the backyard, retaining wall there, and then coming out the back here to where all the fun happens. Pool, again, incredible amount of rock work in this property. I love that little table and umbrella in the pool there. Fenced, um, so looking up, all your guttering. And great use of the festoon lights here they belong to the tenants but really nice addition so nice big yard across the back here as well there's your entrance to the back of the garage there okay and then side access there as well there's a gate around the side great spot for a um, little garden shed or something if you wanted to and there's your clothesline so that's a wrap I'll come back through the garage give you an idea of the flow back here through to the front door and then I'll just show you the entrance to the other side of the house here so this is the other side so although I came up the other driveway this is the second driveway, I guess, second unofficial driveway, but totally usable and workable if you've got a boat or extra cars that you're needing to park. Um, so really wide road frontage and nice big nature strip as well. So I'll actually go down this way and show you from the street. There we go. What the frontage looks like so again it's around 11 a.m. on a Wednesday morning here so the street is really nice and quiet so that's your street frontage so this driveway there on the side there all the way across to this official driveway here fantastic so there we go that's a wrap we look forward to showing you through guys we are trying to limit the number of physical inspections at the property with respect to the existing tenants so please watch this video a couple of times if you do have strong interest in the property we are selling properties sight unseen and all sorts of ways at the moment um, so if there's any further detail you'd like to know please let us know um, 
and we can certainly arrange a private and safe inspection for you. Thank you so much. I'm Tara Torcola from First National.